So yesterday I had a doctor's appointment, and I mean, it was pretty good. It, it went okay. I mean, it was kind of weird at certain points in time. Like, he kept asking to stick his finger at my butthole. And like, midway through, he started yelling at me, saying that I stole his memes, and that I should give them back immediately, or else ISIS is gonna come and abduct me. But besides that, dude, the whole doctor's appointment went really fucking good. Well, until he asked about my diet. Surprisingly enough, black tar, heroin, and black eyes meth isn't that good for you? Crazy, right? Also, I don't know what the fuck black ice meth is. I don't even think it's a thing, but I've been saying it recently and a few people have been pointing it out that, oh my god, that's not even a real drug. Okay, bro. Okay, you exposed me. But I basically told the doctor that I was doing nothing but hardcore drugs. And that's when he recommended me this video, this, this, this masterpiece of a video, right? And apparently it's gonna help me with my diet and it's gonna help me be a healthier person. So today we're gonna be watching that health video together because hey maybe maybe you need some tips too dude but the video we're gonna be watching today is titled spit or swallow and the video is made by Whitney yes the same Whitney that literally fucks dogs that's not a joke she literally fucks her pets she fucks her pet so today I'm gonna be doing my video on 10 reasons why I think women should have sex with dogs oh Jesus Humanity is dead. But without further ado, guys, let's just watch this video on if we should spit or swallow. And if you're like eight years old and you don't know what she's talking about, she's talking about dick. Hey guys, so I got a couple requests to do this video today. Okay, first off, where the fuck is this bitch recording this at? Like, it's just five seconds into the video and I can already hear some sort of power generator in the background? She's in some sort of fucking shower slash bomb shelter? Like, real talk, am I the only person that's getting the impression that this person, I don't know, is hiding from the fucking FBI? Call me crazy, dude, but I feel like we just walked on the fucking Walking Dead's cast. Like, look at that fucking background. Is she standing in a fucking shower? Like, what the fuck, dude? I swear to God, if I get a comment with, Oh my God, bomb shelters are made out of concrete, not, 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 not shit. Please do us all a favor and go step on a Lego. Uh, the video is going to be about swallowing versus spitting, spitting versus swallowing. I'm just going to give you my opinion on it, the facts that I know about it, my thoughts on it. I'm going to share that with you guys. Um, if you're with Okay, I don't want to keep bringing this up, but is she on a fucking airplane? Like, what the fuck is that noise? Is there, what the fuck is that noise? Oh, it's the AC, it's the AC. If that's the AC, then the grudge girl is inside the AC and she's trying to get out and fucking... <sighs> like, that is seriously what it sounds like. Okay, it might not be that bad, but still, dude, what is that background noise? Is that a fucking power generator? Somebody, if you're with a guy and you guys have been together for a while and you're, you know each other, you know he doesn't have, like, any STDs or whatever and it's safe. I would go ahead and swallow it. This is the face you make when your life has come to making a vlog, debating if you should swallow sweaty man milk, or if you should just gargle it around in your mouth, swish it around like you're brushing your fucking teeth, and then spit it out. No, but according to my research, and by research, I'm talking about wikipedia.com, the only way someone could actually get an STD through giving someone head is if they were to have like a cut in their mouth and then like the semen gets in there. But here's my question, okay? If you're fucking taking a big fat load in your fucking mouth and you're swirling it around, you're gargling it and shit, what the fuck is the difference between you and then spitting it out and then you and then swallowing it? Because, motherfucker, I don't see the difference. Because it's going to get in the cut regardless if there's a cut, right? But hey, what the fuck do I know, right? I'm not a doctor. Just kidding. Call me Dr. Calvin. I would go ahead and swallow it <laughs> just because sperm is actually really, really healthy for you. It is really good for you. Like, if you look it up, you'll be amazed. So let me get this straight. She thinks you should swallow big sweaty loads, which I'm not saying you shouldn't. But she's saying you should because of their nutritious values. <laughs> okay, dude. I mean, fuck, dude. She even said that you're going to be amazed at those nutritious values. She didn't say surprised. But amazed. God damn. Who else is just gonna start sucking dick because of this? Because I definitely am. Semen is actually only 1% sperm. It's only 1% sperm. The other 99% is various things that are so good for you. It's got, um, it's got, it's got calcium in it. Shit, I need calcium. Uh oh. It's got vitamins in it, it's got vitamin C, it's got B12, I think it has vitamin E too, it's got water in it. 
Did she just say that it has water in it? Oh my god. There's water and semen. I better I'm just gonna start blowing some dicks right now. No, oh not not because I'm gay. Of course not. I mean there's something wrong with that, but I'm not gay. It's because I gotta get my H two O, motherfucker. Uh, it's got protein in it. Protein I think the protein in cum is about equivalent to an egg white. An egg. A fucking egg. Okay, she sits here and she goes on this rant. Yeah, you're gonna be fucking amazed if you if you just look at the nutritious values and come, dude. You're gonna be fucking in complete awe and wonder. I mean, just one big fat sweaty load in your throat is about equivalent to one single egg. One single fucking egg. One single fucking egg. One egg. One single egg. Holy shit. It. Let's see. Come also improves sleep. It improves energy. It improves alertness. It's, it's amazing. It's like a super drink. This is the face you make when you're explaining to a camera that cum is actually really good for you and swallowing a big fucking load of man milk is great. Great sources of calcium and, and shit. And what else did she say? Oh, H2O. Don't forget to stay hydrated. It's good for your hair. It's good for your skin. It's good for your nails. It's good for your teeth. It's also great for your butthole. Really makes that shit, uh, it's like, it's like a lotion, okay? Really, really makes your skin so soft in there, you know? <laughs> what is this, dude? And semen is only like... 5 or 25 calories a dose. Ooh, 25 calories. Ah, that's going to be rough to add into my diet, you know. Really trying to go with that low carb diet and that's what that's what I'm trying to shoot for. <laughs> Dude, wonder if anyone actually has this a part of their diet routine. It's like, okay, so I ate some carrots today. That's going to be X amount of carbs. And then I ate a, a sandwich. That was X amount of carbs. And then I took Steven's sweaty fucking load. 25 carbs. So, if you're Swallow it? That's it? With that much carbs, calcium, and all that shit? H2O? Bitch, please, I'm gonna gargle that shit, swish it around my mouth, really get that taste, and then swallow it. If, also another thing I want to say though is, if you meet someone, like just someone you just met, like you just hook up with this guy at a party or something, I would advise you not to swallow this cum. Just because, you know, you don't know that person, you don't know what they have, you don't know where they've been. Yeah, if you just meet up with someone, like, at a party or something, don't fucking swallow his sweaty load. But it's completely okay to suck his dick. Really, really just vacuum that shit. Try to get all the lint off it. Just for the one guy that this, like, whole thing flew over his head. I'm not saying that it's wrong to hook up at parties, okay? Trust me. If you just met somebody, you know, when you... Yeah, if you don't know someone, don't swallow their sweaty- <laughs> I'm gonna stop using the word sweaty load. That's fucking disgusting. Like, I, I can't even use that word. It's definitely in the same category as, uh, busted a nut. That's fucking disgusting. Please don't use that. But it's not okay to swallow a random person's slimy jizz. But it's okay to fuck your pet? Dude, what? <laughs> Yeah, man, it, you answered all my questions. Now I know that it's okay to swallow a big, fat, sweaty load. And it, it's filled with calcium, H2O, it's great for your skin, it's great for your body, it's great for your butthole. And I just feel more educated and more aware of my surroundings. Keep up the good work, Whitney. Like, favorited, subscribed, donated, and donated my dick. Peace out, Whitney. Keep being you. Just kidding, please don't. Rest in peace, my desires to be a human being. I will be looking to become a bird man, though. But I hope you guys enjoyed this adventure today. If you did, it's your lucky day, because guess what? Holy shit, dude. This is the limits of time offer only for the person watching this video. Only you. No one else. No one else. If you like this video, you will be receiving an elixir to become a flying bird man, okay? It's, it's a great life. You'll be able to fly wherever you want. You get to live up to 500 years. And the only bad thing is you have to shit while you're flying. But, I mean, that, that, that's not that bad, dude. And this, this, this is not a scam. This is completely legit, by the way. No, it, it really is real. I, I guarantee you. Oh, you don't think it's real? You want to you wanna sit here and be like, oh, it's a scam? Fuck you, then.
again. This is real, and you know what? You'll be missing out when we're all flying around taking a shit on your forehead. On a serious note, though, guys, thank you so much for all the support. We're about to hit 800,000 subs, and it's just, it's it's thanks to you guys. You guys are just fucking amazing. Thank you so much for all the support, and thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day, and watch out for that shit, bro. Is it me and my niggas? Liquor in a couple bad girls. Dr. Calvin here. Uh, if we get 50,000 likes, I'll make a video on the nutritious values of drinking your own piss. Been in this fucking mad world, with no fear for the tears. It's fear, niggas here, they revere when I'm coming back. Oh, sweatshirt, yes sir, this is life and it gets worse. But you always come back from the depths, carrot. And if somebody wanna hold me back, I'ma eat him like Lester. Let's work, cause I'm coming with the fear of God. Not trying to be something that is clear I'm not. I'm just trying to get the whole world with the hands.